Hi friends, it's Sasha, and today we'll be reading I Can Handle Special Occasions by Lori Wright. Let's begin. My name is Sebastian, and I can handle special occasions. I am so impatient when I have to wait for a special day. Can I handle it? I can try to keep busy. I can pass the time playing with my little sister. I can help my mom with her to-do list. I can handle waiting. I get worried when it's time for summer holidays. I can handle it though. I can keep in touch with my school friends. I can have fun with my family. I can sleep in every morning. I can handle summer holidays. I get nervous when there are events with loud noises. Can I handle it? I can wear my special loud noise protection suit. I can stick with my best friend so I can feel safe. I can wear earmuffs so the loud noise doesn't bother me. I can handle loud noises. I feel overwhelmed when there is a celebration and lots of people come for dinner. How do I handle it? I can go to my room when I need a break. I can tell my mom how I feel so she'll help me. I can take deep breaths to calm down. I can handle celebrations with lots of people. I feel jealous when my sister gets presents. I'm not sure how to handle that. I can try to be happy for her. I can remember when it'll be my turn to get presents. I can ask to help her open her presents. I can handle presents. I feel stressed out. When I have to eat food I'm not used to at someone else's house, how do I handle it? I can start with the food I'm used to. I can ask for some ketchup. I can try a little of everything just to see if I like it. I can handle new food. I feel concerned that I won't have enough money to buy presents for my family at holiday time. How do I handle that? I can ask to do some chores to earn money. I can shop at the dollar store. I can make presents instead of buying them. I can handle it. I feel anxious when it's a holiday and I will miss my teacher. Can I handle it? I can draw a picture of her and look at it sometimes. I can distract myself by playing fun games. I can count the days until I see her again so it doesn't seem so long. I can handle missing my teacher. I feel scared when I see people dressed up in scary costumes. Can I handle it though? I can make sure to stay close to an adult. I can wear x-ray goggles so I know who is wearing the costumes. I can wear my bravest costume so I know I'll be safe. I can handle costumes. I feel lonely. When my parents are distracted during busy holiday times, I think I can handle it. I can stand close to mom or dad until they aren't busy. I can wait patiently 
until they aren't so busy. I can tell them how I feel and get a hug. I can handle it when my parents are distracted. I feel tired when I've stayed up too late at a party. Can I handle it? I can have a nap even though I'm too old for naps. I can try to do quiet things alone. I can go to bed early to catch up on sleep. I can handle being tired. I'm sad when people I love are gone or far away. How will I handle it? I can share how I feel with people close to me. I can write a letter to the person I am missing. I can do something meaningful to keep them in my thoughts. I can handle missing loved ones. I'm all mixed up when my routine is different during a holiday. Can I handle it? I can walk backward to see things in a different way. I can go for a walk to enjoy the sunshine and the outdoors to help me feel calm. I can know for sure that my routine will get back to normal soon. I can handle a different routine. Sometimes during special occasions, I feel impatient, worried, nervous, overwhelmed, tired, scared, lonely, anxious, stressed out, jealous, concerned, or sad. But I can handle it. I can handle special occasions. And that was I Can Handle Special Occasions by Lori Wright. Now it's sticker time. And today's sticker is Way to Go. Thanks for joining me today. I had so much fun. If you like this story, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Please visit me daily to reread this book and to read new books. You can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Thanks.